What is going on team? We are back with another video and today I just hate cardio, right? So today I'm going to take you through two barbell exercises that I do like, I would say three or four times a week instead of cardio. I'll edit this, like I can just do, like I can mess up like that and just like completely forget what I'm talking about and what I'm doing still. Yes you can. Anyway, for burning calories, for me, the best things are the three benchmarks of deadlift, squat, and bench. But if you want to burn just a couple of extra calories, these are two moves that, yes, you'll say they are functional and they are CrossFit and they are. I'm just going to leave. I'm coming back. <laughs> but um, they're, two, they're two moves that I think burn a hell of a lot of calories and they're just going to get you functionally fit. Burn, burn body fat, but also stimulate the muscle to grow. Today, first first move is a is it a Romanian? No, it's a sumo deadlift. Sumo deadlift, deadlift high pull. <laughs> exercise number one is a sumo deadlift high pull. Uh, this exercise is basically a deadlift into a high pull. I would recommend a weight that is not too heavy. So I would maybe go between 30 and 50 kilos and aim for around 20 reps. You know, 20 reps is a good number to get the heart rate elevated, to get yourself absolutely blasted. And um, this is just a great exercise for your traps for your medial delts. So if you want to build wider shoulders at the same time as doing cardio, this is one of the best exercises for it. And also for your lower back and upper back strength, as well as just your legs. So it's just an overall master plan of an exercise. You feel me? You feel me? He's feeling me, he's nodding his head, he's like this. He's like this, we got a new cameraman today. He's uh, <laughs> he's um, he's on a shred. Look at that, he says coach. Boom. Number two, now you've seen me do this in a lot of videos and it's a barbell thruster. The thing is with this, is it takes quite a lot of flexibility. For a lot of people that can't get a front rack, it's not usually because your wrists are flexible, it's because you don't have enough, it's because you don't have enough mobility in your lats. And basically this is just a front squat into an overhead press. So again, this is targeting the shoulders, the core, and you want to get the explosiveness from your legs. So you go for about 20 reps again, I wouldn't recommend any more weight than about 50 to 60 kilos. Aim for about 20 reps, three or four sets, Minute in between, minute and a half. I'd, I'd say that would actually kill me off. But yeah, great for your legs, great for your core, great for your shoulders, and just great for just fitness. Just general fitness. Fitness. <laughs> fitness. Fitness. But anyway, guys, those are my two exercises that I would recommend you bring into your workouts if you hate cardio. Like walk on a treadmill. Like who the hell wants to walk on a treadmill? I'd rather like ride a bicycle through a loop of fire, like dressed in tights. But they are my two exercises that I would do. I would use instead of doing your standard cardio. They're going to build muscle, but at the same time, you're going to lose body fat, burn as many calories as possible, and just become an absolute functional unit. Anyway, guys, that is the end of this video. Do give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. I'm using my hands way too much, man. I'm like this all the time. Like I talk like this. Why do I talk like this? You can't see me. <laughs> you can't see me. My time is now. You can't see me. My time is now. Um, yeah, so that is the end of this video. Do give it a thumbs up if you do enjoy the video, and we will catch you guys in the next one. Boom!